the lack of 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 the and um, yeah, the app I'll see you guys in Boyd though, but I just wanted to show you who I'm fine with and who I'm okay. excited to fly with. Okay. Woo, we've made it to Buffalo. Again, another long day, but we are finished. We have like 17 hours here in Buffalo. It is freezing like below zero cold. We are headed to the hotel. I want to say that I'm tired, but not really. I think it's like 12, what time is it? 12.30. 12.30, yes, 12.30 Eastern time. So, which isn't too bad, cause you know, your girl lives in the Midwest. But um, we are headed to the hotel and I will see you guys there. So we've made it to our beautiful hotel here in Buffalo. Kind of see a little bit. Um, but yeah, we're here and we're gonna head up to our rooms very, very shortly. And how nice is this, thank you, that we get complimentary water and snacks. You can never go wrong with um, free stuff, right? My driver's actually on the way back up here for you. He about 10 minutes. All right, let's head upstairs. What's crazy is I've eaten a lot today. I've had chili with um, tortilla chips. I've had oranges and I had a little bit of my salad. And I'm still hungry. I'm like, Jesus, why am I so hungry? What is going on? Or I think I'm just like greedy because majority of the times like I eat when I'm bored. You said what? I said we were being in the basketball. Oh, that's when you had text me. And I was like walking in the hall like, Ashley, you gotta talk to me. There's too many of them. Right, you had text me. You was like, oh Lord Jesus. <laughs> You're like, oh. All right, oh. Lord, they here. Oh, dang, what are you tonight? <laughs> The snow looks so pretty outside. It's so cold. This is terrible. I know, they shouldn't have carpet. It should be like hardwood floors because dragging a bag. A strip for us. Right. <laughs> Something. Ah, my toe. <laughs> All right, I only got one. All right. So, Christina has. Christina apparently has double beds and I only have one, but we're gonna change it to our clothes and head downstairs because I am hungry. Before I go, I have to show you guys my room and I'm gonna turn on some lights because I need to um, check some stuff out. All right, what up, any crazies? Nobody's there. All right, let me show you. So, that's the door, walking in, we have the bathroom. I guess I'll show you that. Hmm. And then the closets. Ooh. <laughs> a mirror that I absolutely love, because it's full body, you get to stand in it, dance in it, do whatever you need to do. Then it's one bed, that's fine. A chill out area dusk area and then the famous view it's probably not gonna be much cuz I'm on the third floor whoops all right Ooh, that's a rooftop amazing um, good morning from Buffalo um it's about 1030 it's very unfortunate that we were unable to go down for breakfast because y'all guess what time breakfast ended? <laughs> 10 o'clock. I'm like seriously, I need to start writing letters. Not complaining, but just a suggestion. Breakfast should stop at like 11, 30, 12 because then that's lunch, you know, noon is lunch. Anyways, it's quite okay. We are going to this little breakfast spot that is a five minute drive and it seems like their breakfast is pretty good and they're reasonably priced so we're gonna go there because and they're open for MLK Day. and they're open for the holiday you guys know how much we um know how much I love breakfast so we're gonna take an uber on over there and I'll show you guys <laughs> thank 
you. So we finally made it to Breaking Eggs Preppery Express, and they are so friendly in here. They immediately were trying to find us a table. We thought the wait was gonna be long, but it wasn't. But everyone is so nice here. I'm like, I just feel so welcome. Me and Christina feel so welcome. Say hey, girl, hey. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm looking at this, we were looking at like the waffle dog, so it's literally just a corn dog, but it has waffle um, batter, I guess. They look so good. Let me show you guys the thing. Get an omelet. All right, ladies. We're going to go over some of our other specials with you. Sure, go so for our it. Soup today is going to be a cream of cauliflower, and then our omelet today is going to be a ghost pepper omelet, and that's going to be served with sliced up avocados, diced um, tomatoes, crumbled up bacon, and then the ghost pepper cheese on the inside. Oh. And the last one that we're running is the um, corned beef hash. So corned beef mixed in with our potatoes, roasted red peppers, caramelized onions. Oh, so good. I'm like, I need that. I need that too. Two okay. poached eggs with hollandaise. Oh, I want that. Yeah, I was gonna say we'll take. Well, we'll take that. Okay, we'll both. Yes. On it. All right. But does that come with um, maybe pancakes or? It, you can do that separately. <laughs> Nice here. Yeah. Like everybody just keeps smiling. It's early in the morning. I love it. I love the energy here. So two hash? Yes, please. All right. Did you mention eggs in that? I'm sorry. Yes, two poached eggs. Okay. Can I make that scrambled? Absolutely. Okay, we'll make that scrambled hard, please. And I want to just order like a couple pancakes. All right, so we ordered the two pancakes and the, what did he say, the corned beef hash brown? We didn't know that he came with fruit. Christina ordered the same exact thing, but she got... What is it, poached egg? Yeah. yeah. Yum yum. So we made it back from breakfast. And oh my god, y'all. It was delicious. I never um get like corned beef in my skillets. And you know, the skillets are with the potatoes, the eggs, and like tons of vegetables and then the meat. But I never have had corned beef. And I got corned beef this time and it was absolutely delicious. And at this point, I'm super full and I'm tired and I need a nap definitely before um, I go to work. So I was trying to decide if I wanted to um, go to sleep or start getting dressed. Because if I take a nap, I'm not going to have enough time to like get fully dressed. Meaning like, you know, full shebang makeup. But if I start getting dressed now, then I can wear the full shebang. But I think I'm feeling more of a red lip and a mascara day even though this isn't day three this is day two i think i'm gonna just do red lipstick and mascara because i'd rather relax yep or you know what i might be able to nah red lipstick and mascara day but i'm going to go next door because christina's next door pop in see what she's doing and i'll see you guys in a few all dressed about to head to the airport let me just get my things Sounds like Christina just opened her door. That means she's dressed so we can head downstairs and head on over to Baltimore, then Kansas City. Anyways, we're in Baltimore and we have like 30 minute ground time and we decided to go and use a real potty and also get something to eat or something to snack on. But we're at the wrong side of the Baltimore gate. I'm trying to see, should I go to a further bathroom or should? Okay. All right, I'll be eating Okay. We made it back on the aircraft, and I forgot to tell you guys, we only have like 74 passengers headed to Kansas City. We had a full flight coming um, from Buffalo, but now we only have about 74 passengers, so I'm so excited about that. Um, Christina bought us donuts. We're going to eat that in flight, and we're going to probably board in like five minutes, so I'll probably see you guys when I get to Kansas City. Um, I walk in, I'm in Kansas City, and I'm like, why is my hallway so long? And I'm thinking like I have a handicap room, but I was in store for this. I'm walking in, I'm walking in, and I'm like, ah! I got a desk area, a lounge area, a kitchen, but wait. I walk in, I have a beautiful room, but wait. <laughs> Over here, I have a beautiful vanity to do my face beat in the morning, because I told you guys I'm gonna do makeup tomorrow, definitely. But wait, there's more. I have the bathroom, okay? A bathroom, but wait. A walk-in closet, y'all. What a mirror. Like, this is legit a walk-in closet. Like, what hotel has a walk-in closet? Like, shout out to that, shout out to that. But also, also, we got a view. We're in downtown 
Kansas City and we have a view of beautiful buildings and today is Martin Luther King Jr. Day. The building says I have a dream which is absolutely beautiful. Thank you MLK and yeah this is just a view of downtown Kansas City guys. Side note it's absolutely too cold to get out and do anything like it's seven degrees. We had to wait on our van. The van was not outside. We were waiting. And I was just like, oh my God, like we need to wait in inside. There was no way we were waiting on the outside. I have my um, big old winter coat, but I also do have on a skirt, but I have on my boots. I didn't have any gloves. So it was just like, I was cold. I just wanted to make sure I was gonna stay warm as long as I could until we had to like go out and walk to the van. But the van eventually got there. It took us like 20 minutes to get to our hotel. And this is what I was in store for. Ah! But let me show you guys, I have two views. So I have that view there. Well, I have two windows, probably same view, but I have that view, well that window, sorry, and then this window. So it's just, we just moved down just a tad bit. Nothing, um, not that much of a difference. We're in Kansas City, it's about 10.30. Today was an easy day, it was only six hours. So that's why I said that I wasn't gonna wear makeup because it was such an easy day. Um, tomorrow's our longer day. I think it's the longer, the longest day. I think it's like a 12 hour duty day, but it's okay because today was only six and um, we're done. It's 10 30 and we're done, but I don't know what me and Christina are going to get into. We may just go down to the hotel restaurant and eat, but they said, I think they said they close at like 11 and it's 10 30. So we don't have that much time. I don't know. It just all depends. I'm not that hungry. I'm kind of just bored. And you know, when you're bored, you just want to like eat but it's too cold to like leave the hotel so maybe we'll just see what the hotel has to offer i don't know i'm going to change out of my uniform and into some regular clothes so here our hotel um put together a little pamphlet that lets us know of places to eat that are nearby and you know obviously walking distance um entertainment and also places to visit transportation information oh my god this is so cool so let's see we might go out to so just one Ooh. So I'm gonna probably call around and see if we can go anywhere tonight. And if we can't go tonight, we'll definitely go in the morning. But this is just so cute that they actually take the time to do that. Oh, and then the hotel information is on the back. Because I definitely um inquired about hotel breakfast. Oh, they're done at eleven. Why did they say ten? The lady told me ten, but breakfast is over at eleven. And then they tell us information about the Wi-Fi. But this is so cute. I love this. I love when people are so thoughtful. So thoughtful. Good morning from Kansas City. We are here. We are up. We're going to breakfast because we're not missing it today. They say 10 o'clock. We get up. It's 9.30. And we are going to eat. Um, I was looking at the buffet options and it didn't look too tasty. Hi good thank you just for two it's okay we were like are you guys open or what did you want to do the buffet no no buffet okay yeah thank you but christina she out on her phone she ain't paying attention but i get something to eat because i'm hungry Y'all know how much I love. All right, um, well, we've been pretty much giving everybody a free clinic of where they want to sit at today. So okay. Um, um, a, booth. a booth would be fine. Okay. Um, um all right. I'm trying to sit. You want to sit here? This should be fine. fine. Yeah. Sit at a booth. Okay. Ooh. Oh, it's not that cold. What? This is. It's cold. <laughs> <laughs> we got on leggings and it's cold. Yeah, girl. Yeah, okay, can I set you ladies up with something to drink while you look over the menu? Can I just have some hot water? Hot water? And Would lemon. you like a lemon? Yes, please. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> and I'll take um, just cold water with lemon. Oh, okay. Yeah. Would you like ice or just cold? Yeah, I'll take ice. Okay. Thank you. No problem. So our pancakes, my frittata, and my hash browns. And Christina got an omelet with hash browns and a pancake. Say hey. Hi. <laughs> we made it to the airport. And today, remember guys, we're supposed to be my longest day. I'm supposed to have a flight from Kansas City to Tampa, Tampa to Houston, Houston home to Chicago, 12 hour duty day. But God had other plans. Apparently, they have frozen, what did you say, frozen, frozen rain? rain in it's like frozen rain in Houston, so they like canceled all of the flights. So we're no longer going to Houston or flying from Houston. We're gonna go to, well, from Kansas City to uh, Tampa, and then we're gonna deadhead home to Chicago. Fingers crossed it stays the same, but Christina and I, look, fingers crossed. 
<laughs> I'm happy that we actually do get home today. So, yeah, we and we get home earlier. We were supposed to get home at midnight, like almost 12:30. But now we get home earlier. Yay! Turn up, turn up. <laughs> I guess turn down because it's cold in Chicago. Goodness gracious! Like, are we at the last gate in America? We still walking. My toes are on fire. We ain't even did nothing today. Jeez. <laughs> I think we're at um, gate 44. I think we started at like gate 30 something. I don't know. We've been walking though. Hopefully they stop me because I don't remember what gate it is. But I honestly think it's the last gate in this concourse. Because we are still walking. Still walking. Oh my god, I never knew it was a Pizza Hut in this airport. It's new. I did not see that Pizza Hut. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Last night. I don't need the Pizza Hut, but it's good to know that it's there because Kansas City Airport, it never really had anything but the Starbucks. <sighs> like only the Starbucks. And I was like spending so much money in, like on their little pastries. And it wasn't real food, but this they have a Pizza Hut. It's just good to know that it's there. I won't eat anything from there, but it's just good to know that it's there. We have made it to Tampa. So, like I told you guys, we were, were originally supposed to have three legs today, but God was working in our favor, and now we only have two. We worked one, and then we did head home to Chicago because, like I said earlier, something about the rain in Houston, and they um, canceled the flight, so they ended up just keeping us in Tampa. Well, not keeping us in Tampa, but, Tampa, but taking us to Tampa, and then we're going to go from Tampa to Chicago. But we have two hours until our flight, so we're just walking around the airport, <laughs> looking cute. <laughs> but no, seriously, I need to find something to eat. But I'm kind of sad because Tampa's airport used to have a Quiznos, but they closed it down because they're remodeling the, full, the whole thing. And so now they don't have it. And so I'm trying to figure out what I'm gonna eat. But I need something though, because I didn't eat. Um, I haven't eaten since breakfast. I know, right? Oh, he loose too. All right, we're just gonna go the other way. Look, those dogs just hanging out right there. Loose, loose than a goose. Oh, you know what? They low key probably don't have no type of restaurants because, no, that's what I was saying. like, none at all. Jesus, they don't have one. They don't have one restaurant because it looks like this is all they have. Huh? I'm hungry. They let us out at B1. We didn't have to walk all the way from B24 like we thought. So God is good. We are freshly landed and. Chicago, we're home. We are home, we are home. I'm not that tired, it's like 10.30. But I'm happy to be home, I'm happy to be done. Especially with thinking that we were gonna be stranded in Tampa. And we made it home. Yay, yay. All right, turn up, turn up. But y'all, I'm gonna post the vlog here because your girl is tired. Go ahead, like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube. And I'll see you in my next vlog. Say bye, Christina. Bye. <laughs> but um, we're at the airport we are headed to um, our gate we're going from Columbus to Atlanta and then Atlanta all the way to LA